Good morning guys, so today I just want to do a speed test of the old internet where you guys can see what it was before I fixed it. And it was quite slow, I gotta say, we could barely stream videos without it bothering 900 times in a thing. Um, so this is the old speed test, I just want to show you guys it, give you guys an idea. We were using point to point towel out here, it's just too thought we're 9 miles from the towel. And the uh, satellite internet's too slow. So this is about our only option. And uh, I looked around, did some research, and this is what I came up with. So hopefully this helps you guys too. Alright guys, this is going to be the first link in the description here. This is the site I've used to purchase the router box and my internet plan through. And I've had no issues with them. They have great customer support. Um, they got some great incentive if you use them. If you don't like to sell this within 30 days, you can send back uh, the stuff you purchase through them with just a small fee, I think, for restocking. I don't know what that amount would be, but I'm sure it's not much, probably $30. Um, here is the cost of the SIM card every month, and they use AT&T towers to connect to. Um, it's $89.99. 89 cents a month, I mean. Um, I've had no issues with them. They got a coverage map and all kinds of stuff. Um, just email them and ask them if they can get you coverage in your area. They should be able to give you a pretty accurate estimate. This is the box I've used here. I purchased it through them because it was cheaper to get through them. And then I used their SIM card here. So just sign into their site and just check it out. Um, read their plan, see if that's something you'd be interested in doing. Um, the antennas, antennas are cheaper on Amazon, that's why I use Amazon and Code is a lot cheaper on Amazon, what I found, what I have in the description, and I'll be showing you guys a video of that next. Alright guys, this is the cable I was telling you guys about. Um, I've had no issues with it, and I enjoy it. It's cheap too, $16 for 49 feet of it. I can't complain. I mean, I've had no issues with it. It has an SMA connection. And then your in connection here with all this, um, through your antennas. I'll show you. So, what you would do is this would come from your router box out to your antenna. You'd need two cables. And then this is the antenna I'm using. It comes with two plugs on it, so you won't need two antennas. Um, we're about four and a half miles from the antenna. It works okay. I mean, it could work better. But I can't complain. I mean, we get pretty decent speeds from what we were getting here. What I recommend for anything or for miles would be an option like this. You would need to buy two of them, though at $69 a piece and then they would be mounted like this and then the cords run down into your house into your router box so that's the option um, this is another option if you guys have got really far distance you guys are without middle of nowhere really far like I'd say anything over six seven miles eight miles you might want to go with this option here what this is, is an antenna that can reach 10 miles, but it's kind of hard to balance in and stuff. You do have to assemble it, um, but I'll put a video in the description about this a guy who was talking about this antenna. Give you guys some more information about it if you guys do it really thought away. You don't think you might not get connection, so this might be an option for you. Alright, now I'm going to show you guys my setup. Right there's a video and how the cord is way in. Goes down a wall, down to there. There was our setup. It's pointed uh, northeast, um, four and a half miles. No, there's the antenna itself, the one in the video. Um, what it has is two cables coming down, and then you get yourself two of those cables I was telling you guys about. And then they both run back into the house into the router box. So right here is the Mothi router box, what I was showing you guys. 
So in place of where those two antennas would go heel and heel, I have put these cords what with on Amazon what I showed you guys. It runs out the wall there outside. And it just takes a SIM card on the side. Right. Sorry. Right there. Just slides in. And that's pretty much the box. I'll show you guys the software end of it in a little bit in this video. Um, that's pretty much it. Alright guys, this is the back door of the multi bottle box I was telling you guys about. I'm going to sign in here. And I'm going to do a quick check here. Show you guys the speed of the internet bars I was getting. Like I said in the past, I'm not getting very good internet bars here. And we get pretty good speeds. I'm getting 14 megabytes download most nights. So, I mean that's pretty good. I have anything out up to 15 um, download. So, from one megabyte to this, oh man, it's night and day. So another thing I'm going to show you guys is this bandwidth total usage here. We used 802 gigabytes. And I haven't seen no change at all with our speeds. They've just been great. I mean, every once in a while when you get a good rain or good snow, um, cause the distance I am away from the tower, it kind of affects it a little bit, but not bad. It only drops a couple megabytes. And that's pretty much it in this end. There's more stuff I can show you, I guess, uh, in the future. I might make a couple more videos. But to set this up, this is really easy. Um, when you purchase it from that website, it already comes all set up throw your KOU um, AT&T and what other, what other KOU you have it's really easy to set up um, there's plenty of videos out there on it so don't be intimidated by that aspect of it because it ain't very hard to do you just put the SIM card in and then click the KOU you're with and then it will auto set up that and connect you to the towel so I would not be concerned about that end of it, just letting you know that. Well, I think that's, I colored everything I know with the color. I hope I helped somebody out and have a good day. If this information helped you guys out at all, can you guys give it a thumbs up and subscribe to the channel?